Hello and welcome to a quick demonstration of package hierarchy through APIs. My name is Prashant and I'm a solutions architect with Amazon Business. Package hierarchy provides the ability for brand authorized sellers and brand owners to create and maintain the relationships between ASINs and its configurations. We will first start by making get calls on product types to ensure that the product type is eligible for package hierarchy. We'll then make get calls on the unit, the case, and the palette and ensure that the listings already exist. We'll then make some patch calls and make some updates to the package hierarchy attributes, which links the unit case and the palette in the backend. We'll then make some get calls to validate that the attributes actually got updated. And finally, we'll look at how to remove these attributes in case we made a mistake in linking to the wrong product or linking the wrong number of products and other use cases. All right, I'm going to switch to Postman here and make a get on product types for a hardware product type. And I'm looking for two specific attributes. Package contains SKU and package level. All right, let's go make get calls on the listing items and make sure that the unit case and the palette exist. So my unit is called demo SKU unit. Moving on to the case, my case is already created. And finally, my palette is also already created. Now let's go link the unit case and the palette. We want to start with the actual unit. We are doing a patch call on the listing items uh, endpoint on the demo SKU unit. And we are replacing the package level attribute to designate this as the unit. That was accepted. We will then move on to the case and make two updates again through a patch call. First, we will replace the package level attribute to designate this as the case. And we will replace the package contains SKU attribute to indicate that this case contains 12 units. Hitting send and that's accepted. And finally, the update for the palette is also similar in that we are designating the package level as the palette and we are performing a replace operation on the package contains SKU attribute to indicate that this palette contains 12 cases. All right, that was accepted as well. Now let's quickly go validate maybe just on the case and let's do a get call and searching here for package, we see that the package contains SKU attribute is available as well as the package level of case is also updated. Finally, moving on to removing these package hierarchy attributes, we want to make sure we start at the highest level at the palette. So let's go perform a patch operation. In this case, we are deleting the package level attribute of palette and deleting package contains SKU attribute and essentially removing the 12 cases which are contained within this palette. Let's hit send, that was accepted. The operation is similar for cases where we are removing or deleting the package level as case, and we are deleting the package contains SKU attribute, which contains 12 units right now. Hitting send, that operation was accepted. And finally, for the unit, we want to make sure that we delete the package level attribute and remove the unit. Let's go validate quickly. Doing a get operation on the case again, we see here that the package hierarchy attributes have been removed. So yeah, that's package hierarchy through APIs. Thank you.